when I hear a woman say, um, you know, make a man wait 90 days before you have sex. If I said, okay, then you need to wait 90 days before he takes you out on a date. You need to wait 90 days before he spends a single dollar on you. You need to go ahead and talk to him every day or however often for 90 days before he decides to invest in you as you are going to be invested in him. For a man to vet you, it is the standard to spend money. Okay, for me to get your time, I have to spend money somewhere. Most in most cases, I got to take you on a Capitol Grill. That's going to cost money. I got to take you at a place that you deem is valuable for you to sit at. Right. Which is going to cost me money instead of saying, hey, you know what? The realistic thing is, if we just sat here and talked to each other for 90 days and I'm like, OK, cool. If I FaceTime you, I can't FaceTime you more than, you know, once or twice a week unless I had actually started to invest money in you for 90 days. I'm wrong. So I'm not saying that okay. your box is in exchange for money. What I'm saying is that for me to actually get your time, I have to spend money. But yeah, I can spend your money and get your time, but never get nothing out of it is not fair to a man. This is probably the only time I have ever agreed with him. And I think a lot of people misinterpreted what he was trying to say. Because he's not necessarily saying if a man takes you out on a date, that automatically means you need to jump in bed with him. That's not what he was saying. If a woman says, you know, I'm going to wait 90 days before I have sex with you, that is completely acceptable. Which it is. Do not get me wrong. If you do not want to have sex before 90 days, ladies, you do not have to if you're like i want to get to know you more before laying down with you absolutely do that you should do that honestly what he's saying is that if a man were to say well i don't want to spend a whole bunch of money on this woman until i get to know her before 90 days whatever that statement gets met with so much pushback if he were to say i don't want to go drop two three hundred dollars at stake 48 until i get to know you a little bit better all of a sudden he's broke he's not a man he's this he's that it's okay for women to set certain boundaries at the beginning stages of a relationship but a man is expected to be a hundred percent invested out the gate and that's the part that's not fair